Today, we got some fresh updates on Samsung's One UI 7.0 beta for the Galaxy S24 series. Samsung has just rolled out a new hotfix update for One UI 7.0 beta users in Europe and India. This comes after the fourth beta version was released in the US last week. The latest beta update is now available for Galaxy S24, S24 Plus, and S24 Ultra users in India, Germany, and Poland. According to ex-user Tarun Vats, this update has a firmware version ending in ZYBF and is around 450 megabytes in size. The main fix? It addresses a bug that was causing a drop in the screen refresh rate on the Galaxy S24 Ultra. Samsung may have also included other minor bug fixes and optimizations. So, if you're part of the One UI 7.0 beta program and you live in one of these countries, you can install this update by heading over to Settings greater than software update greater than download and install. Now here's something interesting. Rumors suggest that Samsung will release two more One UI 7.0 beta updates for the Galaxy S24 series before pushing out the stable version. According to reports, Samsung is expected to roll out the stable One UI 7.0 update in April 2025, with most flagship and mid-range devices getting the update by May 2025. So, what do you think about Samsung's approach to One UI 7.0? Are you experiencing any bugs or are you excited for the stable release? Let me know in the comments below. UI 7.0, you might have noticed that Samsung is facing some delays compared to its usual schedule. Now it looks like Samsung might take a surprising step. They could skip One UI 7.1 and One UI 7.11 altogether and move straight to One UI 8.0. A few weeks ago, we reported that Samsung was forced to cancel the One UI 7.1 update due to delays with One UI 7.0. Now, well-known tipster Ice Universe is claiming that Samsung plans to bypass One UI 7.1 and One UI 7.11 completely and release One UI 8.0 directly after One UI 7.0. If this turns out to be true, Samsung's upcoming foldable devices, the Galaxy Z Flip 7, Galaxy Z Fold 7, and even the rumored dual folding phone could launch with either One UI 7.0 or One UI 8.0 as One UI 7.11 seems to have been scrapped. So why this sudden shift? Well, it looks like Google is planning to release Android 16 earlier than expected, which might not have left Samsung enough time to develop both One UI 7.1, One UI 7.11, and One UI 8.0, which would be based on Android 16 all at once. As a result, Samsung might have decided to skip the intermediate updates and focus on launching One UI 8.0 later this year. One UI 7.0 made its debut just last month with the Galaxy S25 series, and it's already rolled out to some of Samsung's budget and mid-range devices, including the Galaxy M06 5G, Galaxy N16, Galaxy A36, and Galaxy A56. However, the update is still not available for last year's flagship models like the Galaxy S24, Galaxy Z Flip 6, and Galaxy Z Fold 6. So what do you think? Do you think skipping One UI 7.1 and 7.11 is a smart move? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below.